Hey guys, Jewelfish here. Welcome back to a brand new episode of the Archon Faction series. Guys, we are here with a brand new series. And guys, make sure to hop on the server using my IP, jewelfish.archonhq.net, and use the code Jewelfish at the store checkout for the free Hermes rank, guys. You can get a free lowest rank on the server here just by using my code on screen right now. So go ahead and do that if you are new to the Archon. But basically, guys, in this brand new series, it has been forever since I've recorded the Archon Faction, guys. So I'm super excited to get back on this sections grind. We are going to have a ton of PvP, a ton of grinding going on, and just all that sort of stuff. Ton. But let's go ahead and check out the base, check out all the stuff we have. And as you can see, we have a purchase ready to claim on screen. But for this series, guys, we are going to be joining the Faction Africa. So if we check slash F top, we can actually go and see that they are F top two right there with $3 billion of worth. And they do fight Broccoli, the top faction a ton. And I believe Royal and Dr. Kenny Mine are actually inside of Broccoli. So hopefully in this series, we go ahead and fight them. But yeah, basically, I was just looking for a faction in Africa, went ahead and invited me. And they are literally F top two. So we got to do a bit of grinding for them. On what the heck? All right, we're back on. I kind of got interrupted, but basically we're going to have to do some grinding for them, make them some money, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys their base because it is really OP. They have a very nice layout. They got all the stuff that a faction needs in their base. So let's go ahead and head over to their base, do a little bit of a showcase, and then I actually do have some crates to go ahead and open for today's video, which I think are going to be pretty OP. All right, guys, so we are over here at slash F4 Blaze, and basically this is where all the Blaze grinding gets done. People come over here, slay the Blazes, and get a ton of EXP. So basically, we already made eight levels just like that. So that's basically how they get their custom sets, and I was actually given a custom set from one of the, uh, actually the faction leader himself. And basically, this is what a god set looks like. It's generally prot like five, and has tank three, beast three, uh, like scoot three, all this ge generic stuff like beast three. But I believe there used to be a Hulk boost enchant, but I don't think that's a thing anymore. But yeah, basically god sets are like the meta. So basically we come over here once we have this god set on we have strength 2 and we're able to instantly kill these blazes and you can see we already have like level 37. Now this actually isn't a max god set. He told me there's a few enchants I'm actually missing. So basically he also gave me this freaking anti-tank enchant which we can go ahead and put on our tank uh, pants right here. Oh my god I can't speak. Put it in slash anvil and there we go guys. We got another set and there we go. We got some anti-tank 2 on my freaking armor over here looking sick and uh, I'm not even sure what that does guys i got a lot to learn but basically if you type slash ce you can see all the enchants on the server over here and let's see what anti-tank does it does comparable to thurns but doesn't take away durability oh, okay so basically it does damage to your enemies as they're hitting you i believe so that is pretty op all right guys so basically the only enchant i'm actually missing from my god set is blaze one and then hopefully after that we could get some pvp i'm not too sure though let's go ahead and head over to slash ce and basically we could purchase custom enchant now is blaze one a tier three or like tier one what level is it would you say uh it's a tier one because it's blaze one all right, so we're just going to spam it over here, see if we get a Blaze 1, and uh, yeah, so I'm very new to all this faction stuff, guys. As you can probably tell throughout today's video, like, I've literally, like, been asking a million questions. There we go, guys. We got the Blaze 1, and I think that goes on my chest plate, guys, and this will give us fire resistance. So, with the partner rank, we actually have Slash Anvil added up on the Blaze 1 to the chest plate, and there we go. We now have a max set because each piece of armor can only have five enchants, including vanilla enchants. So, we are maxed out, ladies and gentlemen. So with my first god set all set up guys, I think it's the part you guys want to see. I'm going to go ahead and open a monthly crate. Now these monthly crates are literally the best on the server, like the best crate the admin told me. Or not the admin, the actual faction leader told me. He was like, the January crates are definitely the best thing you are going to get from this opening. So there we go guys, we got the spawner crate and a ton of freaking special crates crystal crates spawner crates a special key bundle and a january crate guys so that is going to be really op we got a lot of ggs in the chat over here oh oh we're already opening it i was not expecting that i accidentally right clicked so basically click to spin spin for cosmetic <clears throat> spin for epic spin for epic spin for epic okay this seems really op basically it's just going to spin a million things at once and uh, it's going to make a lot of dinging sounds of course because it's a monthly crate but yeah let's see if we get a january tag two to two two to three tier three mcmmo pouches nine to thirteen chunk busters got one to two, one to three tier three xp pouches uh more pouches two spawner boosters okay those are pretty good i'm pretty sure got some good stuff we got some more mcmmo pouches lots of boosters and a sharpness seven sword guys there we go i was really hoping we got that this is literally the highest sharpness you can get it's an admin item guys so we just got the best sword on the server from a freaking monthly crate guys that is insanely op let's get some hypes in the comments for that 
And guys, we also have our special key bundle we still have to open in today's video, guys. So basically, what that gave me is 10 crystal crate keys, 8 spawner crate keys. We got 14 special keys, which are really good, apparently. Like, they give some cell ones that are unlimited. An auto cell harvester, Whoa, which is a donator item. We got the blaze disguise, some really good disguises, low OP tags, and then creep responders, which are decent. Void chests are really good, I'm pretty sure. Patriot kit, which is also very rare. So let's go ahead and store the rest of my stuff over here. We don't even have permission to store all this stuff. So let's store all this stuff in my PV1. And I guess it's time to start opening some crate keys over here, guys. So let's go ahead and start off with the crystal crate keys. So basically, we can instantly open them. And I just accidentally activated a two EXP booster, two times EXP booster. Did not mean to do that. Okay, I'll I'll start opening on my ninth slot. That way, I don't instantly open. We're going to open all the crystal crate keys just like this, guys. And it's basically instant. What I'm doing is I'm opening it, then I'm closing it right away. And we will see what we get from all our crystal crate keys, guys. And there we go. We got two bedrock just like that guys got a tier 3 exp couch infusion one uh a throne creeper egg three chunk busters and a wall clearing pickaxe this pickaxe will destroy all blocks covered by water that have water or air below them within a 10 block radius that seems really advanced i've never seen that but these spawner uh crates are really op they get some nice spawners like really op spawners so let's see what spawners you get from this sorry i'm running out of breath here guys i'm sorry if you like hear my like really deep breaths like that when i'm talking uh, now i pointed out now you guys are gonna hear it for the rest of the video but yeah let's go ahead and keep opening it i don't know what's going on i think my cat just jumped on my bed i don't know if you guys heard that but yeah let's keep opening these these are taking a second to open here but we got five blaze spawners 11 blaze spawners actually two witch spawners i think witch spawners are really good what did i just get there two creeper spawners spawners and four villager spawners oh my god i'm talking way too fast okay let's keep opening these this is quite a long opening guys like at least we don't have to wait for the full animation but finally 14 special keys and there's nothing else really so 14 special keys will be it guys all right, my cat's being kind of crazy. I don't know why, but let's go ahead, finish up opening all these special crate keys. These are, I was told by the owner of the faction that these are literally the best. Got some money pouches in there and void chest, dude, that is actually really good. Let's keep opening these over here and just spam open them, guys. I think a $10 rank is actually in this thing. Yeah, I think I just saw the $10 rank. So let's keep opening these guys. We still have another six to get through, guys. Whoa, whoa, what the heck? That just filled up my inventory like crazy. What the heck? We got the kit Patriot and oh my God, it's prot six, guys. Just like that, we got a ton of stuff some exp booster a slice of freedom interesting interesting all right there we go filled up the ec just like that guys and then finally five more special crate keys hopefully we don't get a freaking rank voucher again because that oh my god bruh i'm really gonna have no room for this okay looks like I, I i think i'll take the risk of opening one more uh come on don't give me another thing okay spawner booster finally one more don't fill up my inventory and uh that looks like it guys so we ended off with nine million dollars we have a ton of spawners now a cell wand and a, an exp pouch we got a ton of pouches guys so i'm gonna go ahead and take up all these pouches open them all up but we only got two bedrock sadly i wish we could have got more bedrock because i think bedrock is like really op or something like that but let's see what kind of money pouches these are these are okay like one million wasn't too great to be honest i wish we could have got a bit more got some exp pouches as well so i'm gonna open all these up I'll, I'll remember to keep these next time we go raiding on the server guys currently it's grace period so we can't really do much raiding other than just like coth and all that and creep rags don't really have a use at coth you guys get where i'm going at but uh yeah then we got more boosters so I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave some of this Patriot armor in the chest. Actually, most of the kit here, just because I don't think there's much use. Oh, we'll keep the wall clearing pickaxe in there too. We got some spawners to go in place, but yeah, the rest, I think I'm gonna try and keep in my PV over here. Although it is getting pretty full, so I'm gonna clear it out of all its garbage. We got these pouches I still have to claim. Got some spawner boosters. I'm kind of confused, guys. I got a lot to do right now. All right, guys, so we're here with Penguin4001, and we are actually here in the spawner room. He is the entire leader of the faction. He runs all this stuff. And guys, this is our massive spawner room. You guys can see there are some alts in here, AFK and the whole thing. And basically, he set up some pillars for me to go ahead and place all these spawners that we got from the crate keys from. So let's go ahead and place... Uh, am I stupid? Um, Penguin, uh, can you fly up here? Uh, did I mess up? Or... No, it's fine. I'll mine it later. Uh, okay, guys. Well, oh, wait, you can't stack spawners? Is that what this is? No, you just gotta play some straight Oh down. my gosh. I'm so used to, like, Skyblock where they stack. Wow. So, uh, there we go. We placed four villagers, and then we placed, uh, what else is this? I forget. Creepers. Oh my god. But yeah, there we go. And, uh, can I actually see the chest room for all this stuff? Um, so basically down here, there's the void chest, so... Oh, all the okay. mods drop into the hoppers and they auto-sell. I also got a void chest. Would that be of any use to you? Um, yeah, you can stick it in the F chest if you want. 
All right, I'll go ahead and do that, guys. There's the OP void chest we got from the monthly crate. And let's go ahead and type slash F chest. Uh, oh, wow, we got some really OP stuff in here. All right, guys, so we are about to head over to Outpost. But before we do that, we're going to activate all these like three hour spawner boosters. Add them all up to the account just like that. And now if we check slash booster, we now have a total of like 10 hours of EXP boosters. So that is really OP, guys. And uh, yeah, the rest of the stuff I'm going to store. But actually, no, we got blaze spawners we need to play. So uh, looks like we're kind of running low on room here. But I'm going to just place them all at the bottom kind of like this uh we're also missing a post right there guys but uh I'm, I'm not too sure where to place all this okay i'll just keep placing it here guys i'll bring you guys back uh when i'm done and then we'll be at outpost by the time i'm done talking all right guys so we're here in the end and apparently there's like the mycelium outpost here and basically we were told that brits were actually trying to capture this i'm not too sure though but let's go ahead and see is anyone here and oh my gosh guys oh, yeah, there is pvp this is content right here ladies and gentlemen oh, okay, fine. Okay, okay. knock him down he just knocked back he's not back he's sticking keep on him keep on him i can headshot him okay i pulled up he's just spam on him. me i spam bow them he's off he's off oh. he, he, he probably hit that bro he hit that bro i hit it i pulled up oh my god i'm delayed oh i can't bow boost though all right there's two more kids in mid where's he at bro oh place. wait there's one down I'm there Oh, this guy almost quick drop. Oh, this is a whole different. Oh, this bro. what the heck? There's yeah, so there's, many people there's, over there's, here. There's like oh, shit. <laughs> oh, you're caged, bro. What the heck? Bro, who, has, who has a sparrow? Who has a sparrow? Nice. Oh, 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 what faction? Is bastards, what? We're kind of getting ran by these. Alright, we kind of just killed all of them. Well, so broccoli's we broccoli is still kind of coming through. Like, two broccoli came through. Hi, good. Yeah. There's a lot of kids here. <laughs> oh, Do we take it? Oh, wait. No, no, no. They're in. They're in. Dude, this Drop kid's god appling on me. Oh, yeah, yeah, there are kids here. I'm at 60 there, bro. Bro! You wanna, you, we can take it to Arena. We can take fight to Arena. Right, I'm going Arena. I just went through. Yeah. I'm gonna go through Arena. Hey, yeah, yeah. I went through Arena. Yeah. I went through Arena in the north. Get this kid finna. Yo, there's four of them on Jewel right now. I started killing Yeah, I'm like doing the most insane fight ever. I killed one. Go to the northwest. Uh, Wait, that was in me. Oh my we god. Trying to go diety, so he came in. Uh, How do I go diety? Oh wait, diety's a zombie now. Oh. Yeah, this is the top, please. Yeah, I ain't trying to fight that man. Oh, hey, whatever. jump through, jump through. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Yeah. yeah. All right. So if we, if we... All right, guys. So we're about to fight a wither boss or something like that, right? Or the the, the the Aldrich voice or boss? Yeah, it's Wait, not, it's not a zombie. Yeah, it, Aldrich. It's all, it's all Brits kids. It's all Brits kids. First Brits guys to the boss. Wait, so, is, so are we in a like, boss world? Yeah, yeah. 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 Like, they have their own worlds now. So like we can't get PVP after this, right? No. no. Okay, Doesn't just make it sure. Cause like I got player. Yo, let's go! I got the final. We got PVP. We didn't get one sadly. Oh, I, didn't get I got there. a DD crate. Is that good? Yeah, you can, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can, you can go open that. DD crate. That's tough. Bro, I, I came late and I did a beast run. I, I think, I think they should enable run. PvP. Here. I don't even care. I did 300. I got a key and I got you the suck. final hit. I'm so you good. Suck. You oh. Suck. Oh. oh my nice. Guys, guys, oh. guys, guys. Oh Are my god, kidding? I almost won a monthly crate, dude. Guys, oh. one like equals one monthly crate. Let's go. Yeah, totally. Guys, yeah. Nebula yeah. just won a monthly crate. GG's. Yo, whoever just hit oh that like god. button, thank you. Yes, I the likes did it, guys. All right, guys, so we are basically about to use a Koth starter over here to go ahead and start a Koth, and hopefully we get a ton of PvP. I know the PvP throughout the video so far has kind of been all over the place. Hopefully this will start to make sense with this insane Koth guys and i'm just gonna start recording you know and you guys will hear a lot of clicking and a lot of them talking so hopefully we get a kill or two finally and uh yeah, yeah. Actually, actually, oh my it. god oh, these guys quick drop so fast oh no i'm scared of it's even bar, faster with the barn oh there's, there's about three kids here i'm on one let me keep this one i dropped one yeah he's nice. All right, guys, I think I'm about to get my first kill. I don't know. This guy kind of sucks. Not going to lie. I'm just kind of constantly getting hits on him. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I just quickie yeah, thermo. Yeah, I just quickie yeah, thermo. Yeah. I'm in bar, bro. Like, actually quickie him? Nah, he's yeah. in shake here. He's in shake here. Oh, he's, in, he's in, he's in, he's uh, in, what's it called? Grim Reaper. I got his helmet to pop, and he's dead, ladies and gentlemen. That is it. Let's go. All right, so we're fighting two members over here. Oh, we're pulling up. 
Okay, crit, crit, crit. Come on, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be an epic fight in the tree. Hopefully, he doesn't move at all. Oh my gosh, it's like a 2v2 right now. 2v1. Oh my. Oh, no way. Oh my god. Keep him cornered. Oh my god. Let's go. Just like that. Another kill. Let's go. GG. And hopefully, we can kill this guy right here. I'm doing a lot of criticals. Oh, he's doing damage to me now. Hopefully, the sharp seven guys takes him right out. Oh my god. Yeah. He is like slowly looking down to plot, guys. This is an easy kill. If we don't get this, then I'm going to be uh, very disappointed in myself. But come on. Three, two, one. There we go. Another kill. Just like that. All right, guys, so that was some pretty interesting PvP clips. I have no idea what the audio is going to be like that on that or the like really the clips editing in general. Like it might be all over the place. I'm sorry about that. This is like literally my first time recording factions in like two years. So I'm trying to get used to it, but hopefully I got some decent content for you guys. We got a few sets from that. Nothing too great. But now I actually want to go ahead and show you guys the sugarcane farm on this freaking thing, guys. Now on my channel, I do talk about sugarcane farms a lot and there's not no other sugarcane farm that can top this one on my channel right here. Here guys we have an auto sell harvester hoe and basically what we can do with this is we can go ahead and fly across here and it will literally auto sell now this is like a pretty common feature now on faction servers and it is a really cool one on the archon because you can actually upgrade it and it will auto sell but not only that guys this sugarcane farm right here is over 25 chunks long so to give you an idea of that 16 blocks is a single chunk guys so look at just how big this is like this goes on forever and forever like i'm going to be flying here for like a good like five minutes to actually get to the end of this tunnel so we just know that this thing is absolutely op like just oh my gosh like you can literally just like farm this forever so that's basically how the faction made most of its starter money and if you guys plan on starting a faction i would definitely start a faction like this by making a cane farm get a ton of money and then start building up your walls let's go ahead and trade neymar over here he's actually a faction member and i have uh no idea what he's gonna trade me i think he's gonna trade me a tag okay we got a wasted tag that is something for the video guys and uh yeah i guess we'll have our first tag i think i have a few that i won from the monthly crate though let's go and take that see what we get from this uh, claim the tag check the slash tags what tags do we have we got the regular tags which ones do i have show me the ones i have bro oh your tags all right we got january wasted and xmas i'm gonna go with january just because i think that's a rare tag but perfect but that is going to be it for today's episode of factions if you guys did watch this far all the way to the end make sure to comment down below hashtag factions in the comments and i'll be hearting every single comment that does say that because it does show me that you guys are supporting the videos watching to the end and i just appreciate the people who are commenting that a ton so yeah thank you guys so much for watching the end guys remember to use my p jewelfish.archonhq.net use the free code jewelfish even if you guys aren't gonna play on the server hop on claim the code i'd appreciate that a ton but other than that guys let's go ahead and end off today's video make sure to like and subscribe and i love you guys so much and goodbye